always asking what the hell happened, wondering why it all went wrong. And Mom always said, if you can't say something nice, then don't say anything at all. And I've got my side of the story. And that's Carly Pierce at last year's Academy of Country Music Honors. She is back to host this Monday right here on Fox 5. And guess what? She's joining us now. Carly, good morning. Welcome to San Diego. Good morning. Okay, before I get to all the questions, this is very important because you have somebody here in Poway who absolutely loves you, Joella, and she's watching right now from Poway. So could you give her a shout out and say hi to Joella in Poway? Hi, Joella. Oh, you probably just made her day. She's jumping up and down and screaming right now. This will be your third time hosting the show year by year. Is there something that you're looking forward to? I think every year the show's a little bit different and that's the beauty of it. You know, you're, you're honoring different people that have, have made an impact, whether, you know, for decades or in this past year or just some of the music execs behind the scenes that have done some really great things and it's it's so much fun to be back for the third year. Are you going to perform? I am going to oh. perform. I'm very excited. I get to honor my dear friend Ashley Gorley. He's the songwriter of the year and getting that award and he wrote that song that was just playing what he didn't do with me and so I'm going to sing that for him. So you're performing and then you host and then you're a four time award winner. Like how does it feel with all of this happening? Like do you get how cool this is? <laughs> I kind of feel like I live in my own bubble and then there are moments <laughs> where I go, oh yeah, this is like really my life and this has really happened for me. And it's, I mean, I always wanted this from the time I was little. So it's very, very special and I'm, I'm very blessed. Well, I, I, I love your bubble. I think a lot of people love your bubble. Uh, speaking of which, this bubble is heading out on your country music made me do it tour. So how do you prepare for all of that? I gotta imagine going on tour is like a lot. It's a, it's a challenge. It's really fun though. It's kind of my favorite part. Really? I mean, you write these songs and yes, you work so hard, but you want to see the payoff and mm. just getting to headline my own shows and have, you know, this new chapter of music kind of starting. I've put out two new songs that are obviously leading to a bigger release, which will be my um, fourth album, which I don't know when that's coming, but it's coming soon. I'm finishing <laughs> it now. And it's just going to be really special. I, I love getting to be face to face with the people that mm. um, have made all my dreams come true. Where, where are you going? Like how many cities are you going to? Do you know? I think like 14, wow. maybe. It's, it'll be a very busy fall. To, I'm very excited. Are you coming excited. to um, San Diego, like Southern California? Anybody that wants to watch you down here, where can they go? Where's the closest? I want to say the closest is Santa Rosa in November, okay. um, but my, my bass player, he's from Escondido, so he's always nice. very upset when I don't make it to San Diego. How so anytime we can make happen? it, I promise we're coming. <laughs> Please do, if you come <laughs> down here. We have the best tacos, we have the best beaches. He would tell you. Yes, you do. <laughs> we, I, I'm always a fan of going. <laughs> oh, well, amazing. So uh, after awards and fame, when you look back at your career and all that you've done, I'm always a big fan when people like they just do well and you make your dreams come true. Do you ever look back at your younger self and say, you know, that girl that worked at Dollywood, if I knew then what I knew now, what would you say? Oh my goodness, uh, that she has no idea Aww. how many of her wildest dreams are gonna come true. I mean, really all of them have come true at this point and I don't know many, you know, 33 year olds that can say that. So I'm, I'm really lucky. Well, we are very lucky that we got to talk to you uh, today and it's gonna be an amazing show. You have the most beautiful voice and please promise me when you come to San Diego, how many people want her to come to San Diego? Look, I have hands up all over the studio right now. We're waiting for you. I will have, well, even your hands up, tacos, burritos, all of it. See, we're all waiting for you. Arms wide open in San Diego. I'm ready. <laughs> I'm we ready, look, I'll be there. <laughs> we look forward to it. You can catch the 16th Annual Academy of Country Music Honors Monday night. It's happening right here on Fox 5. Carly, good to see you. Thank you. Thank you so much, you too.